So my name is Muhammad Ben Zulnizam and I'm going to present the code and the program of the project. So we made a vending machine uh, system uh, that a simple vending machine system. So we have, uh, as you can see here, is the, the appearance of the program. We have a white text and a, a light gray uh, background. So in our vending machine, we put only four items, so we won't, uh, won't we don't want to make it so too complicated. So we put four items in the machine. So there are four items: tea, cocoa, coffee, and mocha. <coughs> uh, beside here, here is the price of each item for tea is sixty. So we use uh the uh, the currency of cents. Uh, per item, so T is equal to 60 cents, Choco is equal to 70 cents, Coffee equals to 100 cents, and Mocha is 120. So, below here, you can see how uh, will the program will be look like. Here is the, the position of each, uh, every, uh, every word you can see it so you can see it will uh, prompt uh, the name of our program our uh, system for the computing vending machine so here are the list of the items that you can buy and here will be given instruction please input money so uh, we only put uh, the 10, uh, 10 cents 20 and 50 cents to uh we only put that three uh three uh three types of money i think you can say that uh only three types 10 cents 20 cents and 50 cents so uh below here it will show the total of uh how many that you put in the machine and here we'll uh from the message yeah, that you can choose uh one of each item per time so and then it will from the message here is your item and your change so if your money is uh it doesn't meet the requirement you will say your money is not enough you need uh like example you need more you need 40 more cents uh, for example so if you want to continue you will re-enter the uh re-enter the process again and then if you complete it uh the step by step without any problem you will prompt the message here is your drink and it will give your balance so uh if you want to continue you can we continue back all of the process to buy another drink or you, you will prompt a thank you message so this is the display menu uh it will uh for uh, for here we will look to create an empty space above menu so we will not be too uh, close with each other so the user input here will uh display all of the user input <coughs> At first, we will be display the ten cents, the twenty cents, and the fifty cents, and it will calculate all the sets that you you've been that you have insert to the machine, and then here we will display all the, the, the total of the cents, and you will choose your choice of drinks here, and then you will choose the item, and we we'll compare the value of t and total cents here. And jump to body if total cent is equal more than t. If not, calculate the needed amount to purchase. And display adding such message to user. And you get all of that. All of this uh code, and then it will. If you user enter any other option, will display an error. An error message and loop back to the choosing up here. 
so adding money it is a process of adding money if you don't have enough money in the machine so he will uh, if you have completed all the process it will uh prompt you the uh, your balance and then you will jump to all to the error program and if you uh then complete the process uh, correctly it will look back if you use enter the wrong day again so it will he will display the the user's choice and the written change he will have the error handling section so if you want to continue you it will proceed like normal if you if you want to repeat the whole the, the, the process again if you want to buy another drink, you, you will look back to the beginning of the program or else it will terminate and finally it will display the thank you message so I'm gonna uh, present the the part the program uh, start uh, the program without debugging and then the program will run so uh, our group chose to uh, create a computing vending machine so as you can see there are four items that you can uh the screen has from from up so there are four items uh tea choco coffee and mocha so uh, first uh as usual if you want to buy something we need to put our money first so uh uh let's say that you have three ten cents okay you just put the number three okay you have only one twenty cents but you have Three fifty cents, so it will prompt the total uh money that you put in the vending machine. So as you can see here, the uh our money uh, rounds up to two hundred cents. So roughly you can do it the math. Uh, so the second uh the second thing that you can uh, the sec the second step is uh you can choose uh what do you want as as a normal vending machine you, you can choose what item that you want so uh, example i want uh, coffee so we put the number of the item three and then you, you can press enter and then it will prompt up uh, with a message that uh, it says here is your coffee and it will give back your change so as you can see the coffee costs a hundred cents so the change will be a hundred too so there's an option if you want to continue you can press one but if you want to end the the program you can press zero equals to no so as an example if i press if i want to buy another beverage so i can press one and then it will restart the whole program and you can re-enter the uh, you can put in uh put in uh, back sense in the machine so let me do this first okay i have uh, 150 okay i'm gonna pick number two now choco for 70 cents so it will give us the same feedback as the first uh, trial so so this time i want to i want to finish my shopping and then i will press i will enter the number zero and then it will prompt us with a thank you uh, message and then the program will end so that's it from our group